opportunity to review a lot of the information on your website last night, but what I didn't see was an educational background. Did, uh, did you attend college, and if so, where? I did attend, I took courses. Well, when I got out of the service, the first thing I did was I, I got a job in the finance business. And the company had a policy. They preferred that you did not spend your time going to college full time because they, pre they offered very strong training courses for their management. A uh, fellow named by the name of Goodfriend was their training officer, and he was very big. He, he was Ford, uh, Ford Philco and training officer for many of the big companies. And our time was really devoted to the company. We, we, we really had to be dedicated, and it was nothing to work 60 hours a week. How do you fit college into that? You didn't. I was able to, at that time, list, uh, enroll with uh, LaSalle, had a home study course back then. And I, I took a business management course with them. Um, that helped me a great deal in the finance industry. Um, later on, because of demands of the job, I took courses down at uh, Luzerne County Community College as well as out at Pitt State Lehman. I do not have a degree. Okay. So self-taught and on the job training? Self-taught. I, I, I'm an avid reader. Uh, things interest me. Uh, I've worked as an accountant, but I've never been to school for accounting. Uh, I've done multi-million dollar budgets. I have no training to do that. I learned how to do it. I taught myself how to do it. What was that finance business that you originally? Uh, I I was a manager for Liberty Loan Corporation, which was among the top five in the in the country. We had about oh, 700 offices. And while I was a manager, I received a designation along with 70 others out of the 700 offices that were called special lending officers. What it meant was that the company had enough faith in our judgment that we were no longer required to follow the company rules. We had a manual that, oh my lord, it had to be four or five inches thick. And it told you even who you could loan money to and who you couldn't loan money to by category. Attorneys, bar, barkeeps, I mean, they had, they had a category for every, every occupation. And, and one of them was coal miners. Now, my lord, I'm managing an office down in Nanny Court. You told me I can't make loans to coal miners. <laughs> Come on, you know. Um, but that was written by somebody in St. Louis. Um, but that was, that was my, finance, my finance, finance background. And I was a troubleshooter for them. I used to go to various offices throughout the area. Uh, the furthest I actually had to go was to Harrisburg and Reading. When they had a problem, they'd send me in. I would try to work with the manager and straighten things out, and then I was back to my own office again.